You know, I wish I, I could remember that story. I wish I could remember, like, what actually happened. All I remember is uh, laughing my ass off. The show ended at, like, 1 a.m. or something. And we were supposed to stay uh, in a basement of a church or something. But that ended up not being available. So we decided to keep on driving a little bit more. Um, get a few more miles under us because we had another long day the next day and then stay in a Walmart parking lot. Um, but first, we needed our another meal because it had been a long time. And so we were going to stop at a McDonald's, just grab something. I really want a milkshake. I need some coffee. I was driving. And so we went to the McDonald's. We were in the drive through lane. Um, we had collected everybody's order and Debbie was super excited for a vanilla milkshake. And so we got, we pulled up. Poppy just speaking so matter of factly to the, um, you know, the drive through people. I, and I say, oh, and a vanilla milkshake. And, or like, t- somebody else maybe like three vanilla milkshakes. And they say, sorry, our milkshakes, we don't have milkshakes, we're out. And it was like, Okay. She's like, let me get six McChickens, seven burgers, and they were like, hold on, hold on. Our, uh, our systems are down. Sorry. We were so upset. Mostly because obviously it was a lie. They were just being lazy. Maybe. Who knows? And then we went to the next place, and I believe it was Hardee's. First time eating Hardee's. So we were like, okay, that's fine. We'll go to the Hardee's, you know. And we pull up, we adjust the order to the Hardee's menu, and we were like, oh, but they have milkshakes. Oh, it's all for the better. Debbie's going to get her vanilla milkshake. And we go through, and we make our order and ask for the vanilla milkshakes. And they also did not have vanilla milkshakes. It was a tragedy. Um, but... We got to go on anyway, had our snack. That's right. There was, uh, there was a, um, a burger called the, uh, the Frisco Thick, Frisco Thick Burger. So for a little, little while, my nickname on the tour was Mr. Thick. And the best thing about that drive from Escanaba was the stars, because I remember looking out the window and those were the best stars I'd seen I've seen all tour. Everybody who told me the stars were so beautiful. It's the only place you could really see the stars. And I'd been so excited to see the stars, but I was so tired from the past couple days that I was just like, I gotta sleep. Do I regret sleeping? No. Do I regret missing the stars? <laughs> yes. 